Okay, so Follow Bears out on the PBE. We're playing him jungle today. I had a bit of a test with him in the uh, the old practice tool just to make sure that I don't completely embarrass myself as I am one to do. Uh, where I, I I get many YouTube comments saying, Ross, did you even read the champion's abilities before you played them and did a video on them? And I say, yes, I did. But just like when I was in high school and I, I had math class, just because it went in one side doesn't mean it didn't come out the other. And immediately come out the other, my ad. So, right, okay. I, I think I've got a vague understanding of, like, how Volibear is going to operate. And I'm, I'm hoping that um, we, we can we can make this work to some degree. Now, um, by the way, Wilson, one thank you very much for stuff. We are recording this live on Twitch TV. This is probably going to be, like, um, a longer... Oh, it depends how long it's going to go. Because there's a very high likelihood that I'm going to hard smurf it. But I thought, hey, why not get in while the getting's good? I, it's been, it's be, probably been like three or four years since I've like really tried to jump on uploading a, a, a video to YouTube of like a champion where it's been like, like, I'm trying to be one of the first people to do it. Um, I don't think I'm going to max W. I think I'm going to go for Q by the way. I don't, I, I think like just for the, the, uh, the way that the W works with the, the extra health regen is probably like a, a solid move for like sustaining, I would say. If I had to guess, it was it's a pretty decent like maneuver. Um, even I even think talisman wouldn't be the worst thing you could ever do because like you've got the E there, you put the E down there, and it would give you a bunch of like uh, procs on it. But um, yeah, it's been a very long time since I've ever tried to like jump on the trend of like posting a video early on a champion. But we're gonna I guess we we may experiment and see how it goes. But it's definitely gonna be like a longer one. I'm not gonna edit it tremendously. Cause I think like a lot of people are just like curious as to see. You could go and watch. Yeah, you could go and watch Diamond Tier Challenger players, uh Master Tier Grandmaster, uh Scouting Ground players, watch them smurf against iron players. Or you could watch somebody who could be iron themselves in their element. And uh the uh, what you can expect if you happen to play this champion yourself i think that's the that's the real maneuver right there right we're level three that is um a pretty i mean i was expecting I, I was speaking to people in chat earlier and they said that the uh the the queer time was actually kind of slow and that is a bit of a ghost i'm experiencing right there unless he's actually worried it but i think he may just be watching the stream <laughs> you love to see it brother okay I was hoping for a level three, but I, I don't think it's going to be actually possible anymore. Maybe? Hold on. Uh, it's actually very epic. Okay, we got the flash out. I need to get used to the timing on that, by the way. The, the timing on getting the uh, the E down. What's the cool time, the timer on it? Uh, it just says after a delay, which could mean absolutely anything. I go to an airport and they say it's a small delay and the delay is like four hours. And that is not a delay. That is, well, it is a delay technically, but it is certainly not a small delay. Alright, let's get that. Skull crab domination anyway. The E looks so weird. Yeah, I think it's definitely, I think like the E for me is going to be like something that takes a little bit of getting used to before like i actually get to grips with it you get a massive shield if you go into it. i guess it's like really similar to like echoes e in like a lot of ways although i don't think e echoes e actually like does damage if you are caught in it i think it just obviously just stuns gives him a shield but um hold on ein minuten hold on hold it on dude volibear versus volibear don't run coward yeah 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 us 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 Oos, oos. I win this one, my friend. <laughs> Didn't really see that actually working, if I'm being perfectly honest with you. Oh, take that. Zoom. Okay, we got a pick. Not too bad. Alright, I guess. Do we? I'm assuming that he got actual bottom skull, bottom skull crab there. This is going to be a quiet VS, by the way. This is all. This is nine viewers we're doing this with. And um, it's most certainly. Uh, gonna be a bit of a mess. Also, I probably should mention, uh, people that are actually watching via, um, Twitch chat, um, they, I will probably, I link it after the game, but people that are watching via YouTube as well, um, I actually, I'm teaming up with, uh, I mentioned this ages ago, 
I don't think I, I don't think I put it in a video, but we, I mentioned this in a, uh, on stream a while back that we're actually, I'm chucking me and the lads, we're chucking in a couple hundred bucks each, for a, a gaming PC, and um, I will link the the giveaway thing, that uh, Bunny Fufu -Foo set up. So with Bunny Fufu, um, Glacier, and Rav, a lot of people have been trying to get me to do a, a collab with Rav for a while actually, and we haven't figured out how to do one. Because he does like text to speech in his videos, but I guess this is probably be the closest, the next closest thing. Um, but we're giving away a PC. I'll, I'll put the links in, in Twitch chat and also in the uh, description of the video and all that jazz when we get around to it. But um, we're doing okay. Like bizarrely, this doesn't feel like. Usually when I'm, you know, when I play a new champion, I feel a bit like a lost lamb in a, in a sense. Like I feel like. You know, I, I feel like I have absolutely zero clue what, I, what I'm doing. But I mean, like, the Volbear, it's, it's, it's like a weird, um, it's hard to describe. It's like familiar, but not in a way. Like, his Q is fundamentally the same, except it just doesn't, like, knock them up, right? It doesn't, like, fling them backwards. It's still a CC. It still makes you go fast. Makes you go brr. His E is probably the most jarring thing about the whole thing, the whole like kit being different. But even that being said, you know, it does I think I think as far as it goes, the ratios are exactly the same. I'd be willing to wager. Okay. Okay. Send it. He sent it. Can we send it one more time? We have done it! I am dead. I am not dead. I am three and zero. Very good. Damn you, armored bear. It's always. I'm I'm reigniting the rivalry. <laughs> if you don't actually know, I can't remember what exactly the joke is, but there's a a weird thing in the war or whatever that it's like if Fall Bear and Zillion are against each other, I think Zillion gets like one extra damage. For being against Volbeer. I can I cannot off the top of my cranium remember exactly why that is, but it is like, yeah, it is a thing. Um we're we're pushing to level six right now. We we probably should make an effort to actually use our E. Um like to get a shield. I think I probably could have done it there when I was running away from tower with my E up. I I, I can't remember if I had my E up or not, but I probably could have used it there. That being said though. Uh, growing pains currently trying to figure out you know what we're doing also I as I say I'm not tremendously used to the timings on it all but I mean like with camps very useful especially as well his passive as well which is um it basically gives you like a mini static shiv every time that you use you like all attack once you hit a number of stacks kind of cool I'm very tempted I, I I'm looking forward to doing a lot of like meme builds and like theory crafting over the next week it's it's a new champion being released we all know what happens when when that happens is ross releases 10 videos a week of the dumbest things that he could ever possibly do and we've already theory crafted on stream a number of terrible ideas that we could possibly play with i am seeing juice central here right now okay that was like so anticlimactic it kind of hurt me a little bit inside we're still kind of duking it out right now. I'm not going to lie. Right, come on, boys. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, okay. Give me the shield. Very nice. We are still moving. We're still grooving. I am getting that pick. He stunned me. Da! I'm running away. I am running away. I don't have any mana. He is big smacking me right now. Okay, right. We're five and one. I'm kind of like, all right, my bot lane wasn't actually really <laughs> there for much of that fight, but we we did pretty well, ne nevertheless, right? I felt like I was kind of like maybe ever so slightly 3v1 in there, apart from, you know. I, I I say apart from, it definitely, that definitely just felt like a bit of a 3v1 there, but the Silas was waiting for it there, definitely. I think like, um, Silas, um, Ulti with Volibear is going to probably be pretty nasty as far as it goes. Like, uh, what the, uh, hold on. Oh, that is big. Yoink. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I kid 100% just like Eagle stole that. 
Um, it's a bit weird because like the uh, we've had two champions like Set and now Volibear in a row, I suppose, and both of them have always that just basically slam you into the ground. Is that a coincidence? Is because I I know I I know people probably think that I've got my tinfoil hat on here with the conspiracy theories kind of th side of things, but I genuinely think like depending on like who is in charge of c character design at any one given moment in like Riot. They will. They tend to like favor certain de design philosophies as far as champions are concerned. So like, there was a period of time where like the the design philosophy was let's put like mini game three auto attack things, three on hits for max percentage of HP. Vi, Vayne, uh, Kindred. Let's do like a mini game where they have to like Skarner, where you have to get the pylons and yada yada. Like all this stuff. There's like it. It definitely feels like right now. The design philosophy at Riot is um, uh, dunking. Oh no, dude, his shield saved him. It hasn't, well, oh my god. Okay, right, you know what? He deserves to live. He literally deserves to live there. He, he, he deserves it, mate. There's no two ways about it. There's no two ways about it. Volibear, you have my respect, son. He just, he just needs, he, he literally just deserved to win. That's, <laughs> I'm not about to just, I'm, I'm not about to chase that further than I need to. We've got 600 gold, we probably, you missed your chance. I absolutely did. You got the shield off like super clutch and I just, I didn't expect it. I walked away. Volibear difference, my chat is saying, absolutely, listen, I am seven in one, okay? The thing is, with like champions like Aphelios, when I play them, I mean, that being said, right, nobody knows how to play them. So, it's like a totally different ballgame, I'd say. Because, like, you see, you know, pro players, yeah, they can play him. But nobody really knows what he does. And, like, all the, all, a lot of videos that came out for Aphelios were just people basically inting it, right? Volibear and Set. Set was a, is a very simple, basic champion that I can wrap my head around. Set was a champion that I immediately was, like, pretty successful on. Just because they don't have a, a tremendous amount of complexity to them. I like champions that are not super duper complex, right? It's the reason why I probably gravitated towards Pantheon. It's the reason why I think I did... I, I think I'm not the worst set player you've ever seen. That was a Pog ultimate, by the way. That was a really nice uh, thingy ultimate there. Right, hold on. I think I could time this right. He has timed it perfectly. Mine? <laughs> um... I think it's why I did really well on set. I think it's why that I'm possibly doing quite well on Volibear right now. Not everything needs to be, you know, the bells and whistles of, like, everything all the time. You know what? Okay, you know, we change our trajectory here. Okay. Kinda clutch, kinda scary, but we did get it nonetheless. Right, we want we take this, we take this, we take this. I can heal off it. I can heal off it pretty well. Ross, could you announce we are coming top next? See, that's the thing. When you're when you're doing it on stream, you have to be like super careful. You have to throw them for a loop. Pretend you're. I'll. I'll I'm just gonna intentionally say I'm coming top, but then I'm gonna be balling. That's what's gonna happen next time. Wait, don't don't leave me. You have left me. Just auto. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's it. That's the trick. There we go. That's it. Right. I'm going to go bot now. I'm actually coming top. <laughs> He's out, right? <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> right. We got 1,400 gold. Uh, what is the damage on their team primarily? I'd say we got like... it's mo Actually, you know what? It's mostly um, AP damage. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just pick up the, the Righteous Glory because we're building it anyway. Uh, it's going to be great for chasing down people. But I think as far as um, resistances go, that's where we lit. That's where we finish armor. That We're done with armor as far as everything else is concerned. I don't think we really need to pursue it any further. But the Rage's Glory will be more than plenty. Yikes. Oos, oos, oos. Okay. There was far too much key pressing for... Um, how much why i was actually doing there i was spamming my keyboard but there was not actually a lot happening <laughs> i wasn't casting any spells i was smacking the buttons because it felt better okay right this is up we can actually you know what? we could probably do i make the move you know what i think i think i think we just get free terror here actually realistically i think we put that there 
Kaboom. Definitely drawing them ball in for no reason whatsoever, but here we are. Miles are TP bot, so I'd like to make that as worth as possible. So I'm going to head there. They're going to have to stop Herald, so we can just go get this now, hopefully. Right. Let's make it so. Like, Ocean Dragon is be, like, super good. Super good for all of our team, actually, now that I think about it. I really need him not to grab my Ellie. If he grabs my Ellie, we may have a problem. No, we're good, we're good. We're gonna... I can't... We're gonna yank! Oh. Us! Us! I can't move! I can't move! Team! You're all doing an awful lot of nothing right now. Ezreal is full HP. I don't think he's cast a single ability. Ezreal, what are you doing? Cast... Press Q, man. Ezreal, I beg you, cast spells, please. Oh, dear. <laughs> he's just standing dude <laughs> he is just standing there he's trolling me he's hard trolling me now right i will say there's a possibility i got too ambitious i may have gotten a little bit jazzy on it may have zigged when i should have zagged right it's fine we are still strong well we're tanky I don't know about strong. We're tanky. We're living La Vida Loca right now. We're fine. We'll be okay. We'll survive. Well, I think we we definitely have we've, we've asserted that we need some extra magic resistance. That would be epic. Oh, okay. Things are starting to come together. Ezreal has 30 CS in 16, 17 minutes. See, you know, you know, people make fun of me for having bad CS. Okay, right. It happens to the best of us. It happens to everybody, okay? Absolutely nothing to be ashamed of. And certainly nothing to leave a YouTube comment about. That's all I'm saying. Okay, right. Let's bang, bang, skeet, skeet. I do personally like the uh, the little electricity um, aspect of uh, Orn's... Uh, not Orn, sorry. <laughs> Somebody said Orn chat. Uh, of Volibear's passive. Purely because, and purely based off the fact that I know that I can perfectly get my um all my minions to like one maybe two hp and then the minions will finish them off it, it was gonna be great having that like ability to just get my 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 minions to no hp is gonna be great i'm gonna love it <laughs> i'm gonna kill this israel man i swear to god i'm gonna kill him dude <laughs> Oh, everybody backed, and I just got dunked on. I got ulted, uh by. Oh uh, yeah, I, I I didn't I didn't think that the um the the zillion, um I didn't think that the zillion bomb would actually slam me, but it definitely did. Hold on, let's see here. Right, what's our what's our win condition beyond me? I'm starting to think like maybe I shouldn't have just stolen all the uh all the uh the thingies, all the kills. But here we are. Right, who's, who's the win condition on their team? It'd probably be Silas, I'd imagine. That being said, I don't have a tremendous amount of, like, raw damage. I'm, like, a beefy boy, and I definitely think I can win the 1v1s. But, like, in the team setting, where I'm highly CC'd by, like, Zillion and stuff like that, it's definitely going to be a little bit more difficult than I care to admit. Okay. Okay! We're zooming. We're zooming, brother! Put it in front. Okay. Mm, not mm, sure if that was necessary. Wait, hold on. We can maybe make something happen here. Oh yeah, yeah. Where's Where's Mordekaiser? Ice TPing and giggly. I see. I can't do nothing here. Okay, he's running straight in. Uh. Well, he tried. He definitely tried. <laughs> oh. oh dear I'm uh, I'm running I should say yeah for runes and stuff I'm running um celerity and Nimbus it's um definitely like pretty decent for like the increased speed on my Q as well as like having righteous glory and having a uh, predator I probably wouldn't run it if I wasn't running like predator as well but it seems like quite a fun little combo of just like a, a massive burst of speed Especially, like, with Predator and Righteous Glory that we're rocking right now. Okay, let's get some heals. 
Eros, Penta, and no. I'm not giving up. I'm going to try and carry this team to victory. I would love it if they would let me, but it's I don't know if that's going to be the realistic expectation in this game. We're taking it. We're having small victories right now. Victory one is just getting a kill. Level one is getting a kill. Level two is taking a tower. Level three is winning the game. Like we're starting at level one right now. Level one is Ezreal auto attacking. Level two is Ezreal pressing Q. Level three is him hitting an ultimate. <laughs> He's gotten three extra CS in the last four minutes. We're pogging pretty hard right now. The pog champ charts are off the scale. That's two of them hit with the zillion. Boom, they're knocked up. That's a dead mord. Cool. That's a dead everybody. I that was that game, that fight started off on the worst footing ever. I don't think there's much I can do here. Hmm. Well, we tried. Does he have a voice changer? What does that mean? No, I don't use a voice changer. What do you mean? What? Yes, dude. Of course. <laughs> Oh, 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 sorry. Right. Um, can I? This goes over walls, right? So I could. I mean, I probably could have tried to steal that, but at the same time, with the only kills on the team, do I want to? Ezreal, I'm happy to give you these, cause my God, dude, you gotta actually press. Like, you just gotta get some CS, man. You need to start pressing Q on waves. Ezreal, I need you to start getting some form of farm in, in League of Legends.com right now. Then once we start getting you on the board, I think you have, there's literally a wave here. You do not have to like almost die to wolves. You are not going to do very well in that fight, my man. That is a uh, that is a losing battle right there. Hold up. Wait a minute. Put a little love in it. Possibly just, just central. Possibly. No, I've changed my mind. I can get the shield here. I, uh, kind of dodgy. Okay, sorry, boys. Ezreal's coming. He's all attacked. He's eat. hit a minion. Didn't Q once. Poggers. Oh, yeah, Q. I'm probably going hard on this kid, right? But at the same time, come on. <laughs> at the same time, come on. I swear to God, this man is using a voice changer. In what fashion? What would I... I, I don't know. Are you new? I'm confused. I'm, there's some, I'm, there's, I'm being accosted in my chat. I don't know. I'm, I don't know what's happening right now. Right, get yourself the uh, force of nature. Have a sip of iron brew. Are we bullying the Ezreal? Possibly. I, I want him to be better. Can't need the flame actually, bad though. It's fair, dude. Literally, it's it, let, just get some CS, man. You'll pog. That's it, dude. That's it. The the uh, the Caitlyn is not nearly as far ahead as, as you think she is. She went blade uh, um, bloodthirster first time. Therefore, you have an absolute like you have the potential to fully catch up on her. Like bloodthirster first item is not the move. I would I would I would say, if I had to guess, I would say it's probably not the move. My main concern right now is the fact that no pick is a free pick as long as Zillion's around, and I'm not a big fan of that. I'm not liking how we're lacking in the free pick department because we have the potential for Zellion to like completely ruin everything. Obviously, Silas, super duper unbelievably fed. Um, on top of that, oh, changed my mind. Uh, like, you know, the, the enemy volibear is also quite tanky. <gasps> Thank you for walking it straight into me, Mordecai. I appreciate it greatly. Ugh. Right. Maybe we deal with that actually. I'm trying to think of a way that we can maybe succeed in this game. I think we've had a great game. Or like at least a great early game. I had a lot of high hopes for it. It's kinda start to fall apart, like as we get into like the nitty gritty of like, you know, mechanics and team fights and stuff like that. But um like and general individual performance I would say. Like and within the gra the grand scheme of a team fight. But um No, I think like Volbeer is like a fairly basic champion. Not tremendously difficult to wrap your head around. Which is absolutely... Oh, he stole my ultimate. Which is absolutely like a, a net positive. I, I honestly like... Like champions like... Uh, fairly honest, like I've, I've maybe played like three games of. They just don't... They do not spark. 
a tremendous amount of joy because I just don't like I haven't I haven't got them figured out you know what I mean okay that's okay that would have been a probably quite a bad Ornally but people like genuinely just like straight up walked into it <laughs> yeah people just fully blown like walked into it and I can't move dude okay we're alive <laughs> I've never seen so many people like lemmings walk directly towards an Orn as he's ulting. <laughs> it's the self-preservation chip is being turned off this game for sure. Oh dear. Oh dear. Right, we're getting pounded now. Okay. Maybe we can try and do something to save this. Let's see. I think probably not though. I think this is generally the case. Custom games? Oh, I don't have a good reputation with custom games. I don't have a good uh, win rate on them. The people that tend to just want to, like, are decent at the game, they always seem to go on the enemy team. They always smash me. Quite, they're actual bullies. That's all I'm saying. Hold on. We did it. Ah, uh, okay. Fight me like a real player. Yes. Right, okay then. Right, we go Baron. We go, let's go Baron on that one. Don't, literally all of you come this way. Come this way. This way. We go this way. We, we attack this. We attack this man. Right. Boom. I've got the, I've got the smite potential. Don't worry about it, lads. I've got this in the bag. I'm not gonna, he's, the Orn is not gonna steal this from me. He might steal this from me. Right, we do not do this very fast. That being said, you know, I think Israel has picked up the CS. In seven minutes, he's gotten five CS. Which is definitely an improvement on getting four in like six minutes. So, okay, yeah, he did that a little bit late. Knocked down. Close, but no cigar on that, that, that Morgana Q. I, dude, I, listen. Israel? I, I don't, what's happening? <laughs> I need to know, dude. I can't, the, the CS is just baffling me. <laughs> it's, it's scaring me. Right on. We can get him to pop this. There we go. Good pop, good pop. Bring him down. They got dragon. But he's okay. He's okay. We go in! Ooh. I am seeing a lot of no, nobody else coming in with me here. Ah. I'm starting to pick up what's been put down here. Oh dear. Oh dear. Right. We had it, and then we lost it. I was starting to think, yeah, this is good, and then all of a sudden, it was bad. Uh, maybe, are we lacking damage? We definitely, I think what would be a cool aim on him, actually. With the attack speed and stuff, and the extra on-hit damage. Does his passive apply on hits, though? It causes, uh, it's caused to ignite with lightning. Basic attacks deal extra magic bonus damage. It's the closest five enemies. Now, I don't think it would apply on hits. It would be very cool if it did, because then it would, I think that would be probably too overpowered, though, wouldn't it? It would be super duper overpowered if it was. I don't think I think we go for the the wet sand. We want we want some like magic resistance anyway. So like realistically, like that seems like the good option. Right. Can we zoom? Right. Is he got all the way up again? He does have all the way up again. I love the cooldown on it. I'm a big fan of the cooldown on that ability. Oh, full HP as well. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. He's not getting away. Surely he's not getting away. Surely not. For goodness sake. There we go. Here we go. We did it. We did it, Reddit. We made it happen. How did Ezreal end up almost dead from that entire exchange? <laughs> Wait. Yeah, there we go. Nice, 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 nice. Right. Right. I'm coming in to help. I'm coming in for some assistance. Okay. Okay, I popped there. I'm getting knocked around like it's nobody's business right now. I cannot move, dude. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, if only someone did damage <laughs> to him. <laughs> right, push it. We aced. That's brilliant. That is brilliant. That very much works. Got you first. Yeah, I know. I know. I'm fully aware. That being said, I don't know what to tell you here. I don't know what to tell you. Oh. 
the uh, the cool the cool the Q cooldown reset on um, his Q is actually it's hard for me to remember, but it is pretty cool. So if you have your Q up and you're like running towards somebody to do like a little bit of like, or jumping and knocking them in the face, if you get like stun during at any point, it literally it will just reset the entire cooldown. So you can just like bang out again. I can see that being a, a good thing and a bad thing in the sense that like, I'm pretty sure um, you could waste a lot of mana just trying to run at someone <laughs> you run at someone they stun you you're like okay you run at them again someone else stuns you you're like okay i keep i keep trying uh but I, now i've wasted 400 mana trying to uh, get on top of this person was it worth it probably not we stole the skull crap yeah 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 right let's get this down Maybe we put like a little bit of the game sound on. Is, I'm, I think that thing, I'm wondering if the music's okay. Is the music okay? Like uh, volume wise? Just because we're playing like the uh, Ross Boom Socks background music grace hits. Can you hear it at all? It's really quiet. Is it really quiet? We'll try to put up a little bit then, shall we? Volume perfect. We'll put up a little bit. Put up a little bit. We're getting into the crescendo of this game anyway, so. Right, let's get a little bit extra CS. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. We're just kind of slamming. I'm going to continue pursuing. <laughs> that was so awkward, but we made it work. I was like, I'm just gonna jump through this. Okay, I am. There's no chance! Oh, we got him. Oh my god. Okay, we're well, Baldwin's getting pushed in. That, I can't believe he almost survived that. I cannot believe he actually almost survived that. He had absolutely no right. He had no right. You know what? We're gonna go damage. I'm I'm i I'm not doing nearly enough damage. He tried to he tried to do a me move. Yes! Wait, I didn't stun her. That's awkward. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. There's no way she's get Ezreal, for God's sake. Speed me up, Scotty. Unreal. I'm in trouble. Oh. <laughs> oh, dear. You know what? Maybe we actually... I mean, Blader and King probably would work pretty well, actually. Now that I think about it. Ugh, kind of awkward. That, how did... I was literally... He turned, and I somehow don't get the, the, the W on that one. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. How did I not get the fat dub on that? Has no right. No right. Where'd he go? Oh, Mordecai's rolled him. That explains a lot. We got him. We're actually... Um, we're starting to pull through a little bit here. Now that I'm... Looking at the the whole game as a as a as what is, we're doing okay. I don't know how the hell he managed to like actually turn around and hit me before I hit him, even though I was literally staring right at him. Wait on a minute. Oh, I can't continue. I would love to. Oh, it's Zillion. my favorite. I'm zooming! Just hold him there, dude. You may be dead. Yep, walk in at me with that one. Epic. Okay, we got we got both of them. A worthy sacrifice, I'm sorry to say. It may just be a worthy sacrifice. Right. Oh, hold on. I've changed my mind. I'm getting out, dude. <laughs> Right, we're 13 6 16. Oh my god. We've got to have a chance at this. There's got to be something in this somewhere that says we can maybe win. Okay, he's still, he's still Mordecai. So yeah, actually, that works for me. Boom, 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 boom. Right. Let's see. Um. You know what? Yeah, let's let's get let's get funky with it. Let's get funky with it. Right. 
right, we get that there. I think I should probably put that on something there. Because I definitely will use it when I don't want to use it. Or I'll definitely forget to use it if it's not, like, somewhere on my, uh, on my item bar that's going to be, like, one that I normally use for, uh, for blade or for, like, items like that. Ooh. Yeet. It's okay, fellas. Don't worry about it. I absolutely entered. Wait, hold on a minute. He's botched it. He's botched it. Wait. That was so awkward. He went over the wall and I couldn't get over it. But we absolutely smurfed on them there. Nice, 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 nice. Very good picks, everybody. I absolutely entered that there. Right. 36 minutes. Andrew's starting to get some CS. Let's watch some CS now for a moment here. See how he gets on. He seems to be fine at CSing. I don't know what's, I, I don't know what the problem has been this whole game. He seems to CS absolutely fine. I think I'm, maybe I'm missing something. I don't know. Like the lane. In my head, the lane didn't go poorly for him. I mean, I guess the uh, the zillion was probably pretty annoying, but like, I gang bought quite a few times and we got quite a lot of picks off it. And Edge was a bit of a safe uh, CSer anyway, so it's like. It's all a little bit confusing to me, but nevertheless, like, I guess we just, like, we, we work with it. Right, I think we time we back off. We back off now on this. I don't know what we can do for Baron. Oh, it would be great if we could, but... I think, like, if we went for it, for that fight on Baron, that would be, like, the game decider right there. That would definitely be the, the game that decides, like, who's winning. So I guess like final verdicts on Volibear, because I'm, I'm assuming this game's not going to go on a tremendous amount longer. This game is absolutely outworn its welcome as far as I'm concerned, because this team is so frustrating to play into. <laughs> uh, I mean, Electral Zelly, uh, not Zillion, sorry, uh, Silas Abuser, even in PBE, unbelievable. It's bad enough seeing them in ranked, but seeing that in PBE, I don't know about that one. Right, group up, lads, group up. This is a shambles, come on. Right. Get to stepping. Yes, queen. Get the shield down. Get the shield down. Ezreal, when I say CS, man, I don't mean literal. End, they're trying to end the game, man. Please come to mid. Let's get it going. That could be big off of Miles, except it's not. Oh, that was very close. Yeah, I think that's the game over on that one. That's very upsetting, dude. Jeez. Oh, dear. We got doinked. <laughs> I had a great game, though, on, on, um, on, on Fall of Bear. That was good. That was decent fun, I would say. I think um, it could have gone better. But nevertheless, yeah, that was cool. I'd say... Um, I guess this will be an experiment. We'll see how this uh, video does. I mean, it's almost going to be 40 minutes long. And it's just me talking a lot. I don't know. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.